This game, it, it's really only a demo right now. It's called Balatro. It comes with a personal one-to-one -one recommendation from my good friend, Dan Giesling. The uh, selling point, the sales pitch that I got was that it was a poker roguelite. That's all I know. That plus an endorsement is all I need. Hello there, my name is Jimbo. Let me first just let me put myself up here because it seems like there's some relevant information down here. My name is Jimbo. I'm here to help you learn how to play. Next. Your goal is to earn chips to defeat the enemy blind. This here is a small blind. You only need to score 300 chips to beat it. Select the small blind to start the round. Okay, okay. You earn chips by playing poker hands. Each poker hand earns a base amount of chips multiplied by some molt. See your poker hands in the run info area, along with other info about your current run. Okay. Holy. High card, five times one pair, 10 times two. Straight, four of a kind, 60 times five, straight flush, 100 times eight. All right. Cards can also earn you some chips. Hover over them to see. Understandable, understandable. Now select up to five cards to play and play your hands. All right. I feel like the best hand that I have available right now, if we're not getting any more draw, the best hand I have available is um, a pair of fours and then three high cards. We got 36 points. You can also discard up to five selected cards to try and make even stronger hands. Try it. Okay. You had a straight. Two, three, four, five is not a straight. Now I have a straight. Two, three, four, five, six is a straight. Well, I don't want to discard up to five selected cards. I want to. I don't want to discard these. Don't, okay. Well, I mean, I don't really want to discard eight, ten, jack either because you know we're drawing for a straight there. But I'll, I guess I'll discard a, an eight if you're going to force my hand in the tutorial. Careful, you only have a limited number of hands and discards per round. Okay, earn 300 chips before you run out of hands to win this round. Good luck. Understandable. Two, three, four, five, six. I will play that hand. That's a good straight right there. 30 times three, 36, 41, 45, 48, 50 times three, 150 points. That's half of what we need right there. I'm gonna give you Oh, uh, I don't have a flush. Sorry. Okay, we got three discards remaining. Shh, two pair is pretty good. How about, what's, what's two pair in run info? Two pair, 20 times two, but it'll actually be 20, it'll be like 60 times two, right? I'm going to play that hand. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw down a, uh, an ace as well. Holy cow, 60 times two. We just, we just won. I'm incredible. I've defeated the boss. One extra hands remaining, a little bit of extra money, cash out $4. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done, now that you're flush with cash, you can buy some new cards from the shop. Try buying this handsome devil, plus four multiplier. Okay, okay. This is one of 90 jokers, 90 jokers? What is this? Uh, WB's wet dream for the DC Extended Universe? Every Joker does something different. This one adds plus four molt to every hand you play. Be picky, you can only carry six of these cards at a time. Now buy the other card. Enhances up to two selected cards to molt cards. This tarot card is a consumable. This one will enhance your playing cards. Hold on to it. If you save up enough, you can get a voucher. Permanently gain plus one hand per round. Vouchers are restocked after you defeat the boss blinds. Let's move to the next round. Okay, this time we need 450. Choose to skip it to get a tag worth future rewards. But keep an eye on the boss blind. It has an ability you'll need to play around. All right. I think I'm ready. If you beat it, then the ante goes up and all blinds become harder. Beat anti 10 to win. Now choose your path. I select the big blind. 
When you get more cards, remember you can rearrange them. Jokers trigger in order from left to right. And make sure you use your consumables. You can't tell me what to do. Select up to two cards in your hand and press use on the tarot card to enhance them. Okay, I'm thinking on this one, we're gonna, we're gonna use the Empress. To enhance our aces with plus three multi. And then we're gonna play an insane full house. Oh, we, we've defeated the boss already. I'm incredible. 72 times 14, that's a 1,008 point hand. Get owned. Three extra hands remaining, more dollars. Cash out seven bucks. I got seven, I got eight bucks total in my pocket. Plus 20 chips remaining, plus 20 chips for each remaining discard. Plus four molt for each even ranked card played. I'll take that joker any day of the week. I don't think the order of these matters, but it might matter at some point. Now take me to the next round. Who we got? The pillar. No straights are allowed. Chad. Chad, come on. Don't. We don't have to make a joke about everything, okay? Up the ante. Raise all blinds. Refresh blinds. I think we should run. Give me a pair, although we got a great, well, I was gonna say we had great straight potential, but we don't really need a straight. Give me a pair and discard my three lowest cards. We got three more hands, we gotta get at least 600 points. We got 180. Give me two pair. Sadly, not evens. Even cards get even more multi. Give me the three multi on top of this. I will play this incredible hand right here. Fifty-eight times six, not too bad. Now here, I think I'm gonna discard, discard, discard. Send them. We got two pair. Let's send in tens. Let's send in fours. And then this is 20. Two pair. I forgot what the, the amount is. Let's see if we can learn how to calculate the number ourselves, okay? Two pair is 20 times two. But actually, it'll be 20 times two, 30 times two, 40 times two. It'll be 48 times two. Plus, each one of these is going to have plus four molt. They're actually gonna have plus eight molt. So is this like 42 times, wait a second. <laughs> uh, I, think, I think we're about to score a million points. Forty-eight times forty-eight times twenty-two. Like that's that's a lot. We just won. I'm the greatest player of all time. I got five dollars. I got six dollars. Oh hello. Holy cow, this could be anything. Voucher do, not discovered does nothing. All flushes and straights can be made with four cards. Oh! <laughs> That's incredible! Not discovered does nothing. I mean, this makes... Dude, come on. We gotta go passive. Because the passive helps you out no matter what. Blank. Redeemed. It actually does nothing? Well, that hurts. Owned, owned. 800 bucks. If you skip, you get a free planetarium. I'm, I'm, we're not skipping. That, that won't be necessary. Now, let me see what we got here. We definitely have... Uh, we definitely have 9988 and then play. And I've been told not to play a fifth card that doesn't do anything because it doesn't actually affect your score. So we'll save our ace instead. All right, I've like basically defeated this one already. 
while we're here, we might as well try to make like the best ham possible, right? Or we get extra gold for our discards or something? Because like the more we beat it by, no, I think we just send it. Nothing for discards? I think you just send it then. Give me 10, 10, 4, 4. Play hand. Only for hands left. Okay. I mean, right now, we got it figured out. That's like a thousand points. Three dollars. Plus one dollar. Plus two dollars. Four dollar joker. Plus ten molt if the hand contains a three of a kind. Plus one hand size. Reroll for five bucks. That's pretty expensive. I'll take plus ten molt if the hand contains three of a kind, and then maybe we try to get as many discards as possible. In order to, to finesse three of a kind. Twelve hundred bucks, we select. Well, we're not really close to three of a kind, that's for sure. <laughs> we have a lot of evens though. Um Give me three discards here. I mean, we have a... Honestly, I'm going full discard. I'm going to try to do this in one. Give me an ace or an eight, please. Oh! And our hand contains... Does does a full house contain three of a kind? As far as I'm concerned, it does. So I think you send it here. And this is out of control. First, you get your aces, your plus three multipliers. You get your even number plus multiplier. You get your plus four multiplier and your plus 10 multiplier. 2,500 points for a single hand. And we only used one hand to do it, so we're getting three extra bucks. Oh, baby. He's rich. Saturn. Level one. Level up a straight gives you one multiplier and 10 chips. Gain $2 per discard if no discards are used by the end of the round. Oh! <laughs> Honestly, I spend nothing. I'm saving my money. Let's fight the boss first. You must play fewer than five cards. All right, you're already dead. We play our tens. This actually might get more than 1,600 just by itself. We get plus 10 multiplier, and then we get plus 12 multiplier on top of that. And then plus four multiplier. You're so lucky. <laughs> All right, well, how about, oh, I can't play five cards. So how about just, uh, well, to be honest with you, would, it, would a pair get me to 50? That would be enough. Poker hands. Pair is 10 times two, and then these are plus five each. So it'd be 20 times two. It doesn't quite get us there. So I think instead, we literally can't make a flush. We can't, listen, chat, we, we must play fewer than five cards. How am I gonna make a straight? How am I gonna make a straight? It can't be done. So you gotta, I think you dump five cards. I mean, you, you can make it either way, but we'll just do it this way instead. If only you had that joker. I don't need that joker, we just bodied this dude. The easiest game of my life. 300 free points. Okay, five extra dollars plus two extra dollars equals, oh, plus interest. Oh, this game has everything. <laughs> $16 unlocks Planetarium. Once per round gives one of two planet cards. Plus 10 molt when zero discards remaining. I mean, that seems insane. Gain $4 at end of round. I mean, it pays for itself super quick. This all seems insane. Let me get a planetarium. Telescope redeemed. And then let me get, um, let me get plus 10 molt when zero discards remain. And we'll just mill ourselves to like the best possible hand we can seem to get. Skip this blind. Enhanced card in the shop. We're not skipping any blinds, okay? I didn't get the game to not play the game. 
Full house gives plus one molt plus 20 chips. Or straight gives plus one molt plus 10 chips. Well, this synergizes with our three of a kind, so let's give it a chance. Does that only work for this, uh, for this fight? Now remember, we want to get... We should keep evens, maybe. We want to get a full house. And we want to go down to zero discards. Keep your evens again. I know this seems like I'm not maximizing the use of my discards. I would say you're exactly correct, but then watch... Whoa, 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 hang on. Hang on. Well, you know what? We could just send it out first. We'll draw new cards. We can always use our discards later. We don't need to just do it with one hand at the end. Let's play. Let's hedge our bets. Like, we already smoked it. No problem. That one hand would go insane. I mean, maybe there's a boss where we got to get, like, 20,000 or something like that. So... Increases rank of up to three selected cards by one. So it's a one-use card. Plus ten molt played if this hand contains a flush. That would have been a great synergy with what we previously had before, but that's okay. I'm gonna I'm I'm skipping this one for now. Big blind. Start round with an extra two hands. That won't be necessary right now. We should really look at what the boss does. Straight flush plus two molt plus twenty-five chips. Brother, we're never getting that. Three of a kind plus one molt plus ten chips makes way more sense to me. Holy cow. It's already great. Discard everything to try to get a full house. <laughs> four nines. Forget the full house, brother. Give me the four nines. Honestly, the full house might have been worth more, but it's rarer. Or the, uh, the four of a kind is rarer, I should say. How about... Oh, another full house! Don't mind if I do! Holy... Holy... <laughs> 3,000 point hand? Interest, $5 of interest maximum, noted. But $5 of interest maximum, that's like a free uh, item every shop. Plus two mult per consecutive hand played without a face card. High card gives you plus one molt and some chips. Honestly, I'm a hater. I pass. Discards one random card per hand played. We need $4,000 to beat the hook here. So far, so good. Four of a kind gets buffed or flush gets buffed. Give me flush gets buffed. We're in outer space now too. Yes, I, I, I recall. We start with discards to create something with a three of a kind. Oh! <laughs> Start me here, please. I mean, you're probably going to discard one of my nines, which is unfortunate, but this might kill you dead just by itself. Holy cow. It was close. You did discard my nine. I would I would go for the full discard here because if we get the if we get what we're looking for even if we don't get what we're looking for the extra ten molts would kill you but you're you're dead either way easiest game of my life had a flush brother who cares about a flush look at what we got going on here plus ten molt if your hand contains three of a kind plus four molt for each even card. Just threw down 3,000 points right there. 
This game's got a real sense of style to it, too. It's like playing a video poker machine in Valhalla. Foil, holographic, and polychrome cards appear twice as often. I want to buy everything. Foil, holographic, polychrome appears twice as often. Absolutely. Plus two molt for each joker. Absolutely. Plus eight molt if you have a pair. And we may discard this mystic summit. Because we can only have six jokers at a time. Adds a voucher to the next shop. Not necessary. Heart cards are debuffed. Send me. Sure, we'll level up our flush. I guess this is progressive. Maybe I should stop disrespecting flushes so much. But it's... It's hard to care about a flush when I can free solo any boss or any enemy by just playing the most beautiful, even, full house of all time. Holy, holy. Oh my god. <laughs> A little 6,200 point hand. Six bucks in my pocket. Cash out seven. 12 bucks in my hand. Plus four molt for each diamond. Plus four molt for each club. We skip those any day of the week. Give me the interest. This time we need 6,000. Something tells me that's not going to be a problem. You know what? I... <sighs> I hate to say it, we'll, we'll make our pairs better just because they hit more often. With all these discards, we probably don't need to hedge our bets on a pair, but so be it. We're learning. I mean, this is beautiful. Discard me. Discard me. Discard me. Now we're talking. Discard me. Now that we're on zero discards. Play this hand right here. We'll get plus 10 multiplier because we're on zero. This might do it just by itself. Although we, we only have three evens. Oh, 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 it's not quite there. <laughs> Why not the jacks? Well, I was waiting for more uh, jacks to show up for this exact situation right here. It's like you don't even know what the cards are going to pop out. You weren't counting the cards this whole time? It's a simple one deck Marty. You just gotta, you, 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 you do a plus one if you got hit with a, a card that's not a face card. You do a minus one if you got hit with a card that's a face card. It's not hard. You've never seen Rain Man? Cash out $8, I really appreciate that. Plus one molt per tarot car used. Gain $4 end of round. I skipped that. I'm happy with my existing jokers. Hearts are debuffed. We need 8,000 points. Oh, buff my three of a kinds. <laughs> mm. Debuffed. Scores no chips and all abilities are disabled. Would I still make a three of a kind using a disabled card? I think I would still make a three of a kind using a disabled card. So give me, f oh, we could just, listen. Let me see what's going on with straight. 30 times three is not a great hand, but no, we should keep the two because we need, I mean, I know uh... The way we make big points is, is not by making straights. It's by making three of a kind's full houses. So as much as this is going to bother you, we got to play roguelite. Not just poker, we got to play roguelite. Come on. <laughs> okay, now things are getting a little dangerous. We're going down to zero discards. 
We have, we have no three of a kinds. So we have a staggering amount of pairs. Give me aces and twoses. Don't screw me. I, I don't think we're making it to 8,000, boys. That's like 2,000. But then we're drawing. Oh. <laughs> Oh. I have $20. Don't kill me. All right. That's it. Now that we know what we're doing, we will never lose again. That's my guarantee to you. And we could still get some miracle draws. I'm dumping these to, to get high card, to get one more draw. I shouldn't have played the five! Oh! I just looked at it and I was like, it's odd, get rid of it. Well, yeah, we're cooked. This is a cooked situation. Pair of twos. 60 points. Hey, 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 it's not 60 points. Everybody relax. Holy cow, it's like seven, it's like a thousand points, but still. Okay, we go next. New run, new run. Plus one discard every round. That's all I got. That's all I got, okay. All right, now we know what's up. Blue deck unlocked, plus one hand every round. Joker unlocked. We don't know what he does yet, but we know him. Yellow deck unlocked. Red deck demon! <laughs> Red like the lion demon! Easiest play of my life. Aces and jacks, play hand. I guess you only get 50 rounds in the demo, so we gotta enjoy it while you like it, okay? Enjoy it while you got it. Smoke them if you got them. Next step, easiest full house of my life. We gotta build up our synergies first, though. 288, okay. So far, so good. We're so back. This does seem like a game that would be within a triple A game, and everyone would be like, the game isn't that good, but the game within a game is ri Like 12 years later, when you went to your freshman year of college and you were in the dorms, you would see someone playing this and you'd be like, oh, I remember that game. I spent so many hours playing Balaton. And they'd be like, me too. It's like, it's Gwent, exactly. Trigger card in hand abilities twice. Plus 15 molt if it contains four of a kind. Balatro, sorry, <laughs> not Balaton. <laughs> I'm skipping this one. I don't, I don't like, uh, I don't like what they got for me. After defeating the boss blind, get 15 extra dollars. You know what? I'm willing to give that a chance, and then we'll go straight to the boss. No straights allowed on this one. Give me Ace Ace three three. Discard a four. We we play the four just to get the free discard out of it. That was not a great hand. I need to do better. That's unfortunate. Well, let's let's farm some discards then. I'll play Jack Jack 10 10 8. One twenty. Still not good enough. We we need to we need to build a monster hand. It's over. <laughs> it's not over, okay? Oh, it's over when I say it's over. Come on, come on, come on, come on. 256. What do we need? We need a one, 132 with a discard remaining. Ten ten nine nine. <laughs> Please. 
please. Okay, we. You know what? We learned a good lesson there. Keep, keep me on the red deck. I'm. That's that's my own mistake. I got greedy. I got greedy. That's my own fault. Queen, queen. Well, you know what? Let's learn our lesson. Discard your non-matches. Discard your non-matches. To me, this looks like a good situation to play this and then look for a straight coming up. Open-ended straight draw with several cards coming in. Four, five, six, seven. I play a pair of aces, throw the king and the jack for now. Yo, Malph, thank you for the raid. I'm playing some poker. I don't know if you've ever heard of this game. Give me a fat discard here. <sighs> Lads, we're so close to a straight flush. <laughs> we're so close. We just need this to be a six. But I, I'm not discarding anything in my hand because I'm like in love with it right now. It's just a great hand to begin with here. Five valuable cards. Gives you 90 points by default plus the values of the cards. You gotta go for it. It is a six. Yeah, but it's not a it's not the right uh sorry, I probably misspoke. It's not the right suit, is what I meant to say. And it's not a spade. We knew that? Well then why did you say <laughs> why'd you say it then? Hmm. Plus two. This is currently plus. Two. Oh, it's holographic. Wait, what is that? Does that mean it's just plus ten molts by default because it's a holo? I can't afford it anyway. <laughs> but it's plus ten molt by default on top of everything else. It sucks that I can't afford it, but um, your one most played card this run is always drawn to the round. Ooh, that's interesting too. Okay, this time, I, I don't think we need to buy anything immediately, but we absolutely need to buy, or we, we need to win here and get some kind of synergy from our second shop. I would go hard on this right off the bat and play a six just to discard it, and then we'll, we'll hope that the aces can spiral into a full house or something like that afterwards. We need to average like 120 per hand. I mean, seven, eight, nine, ten, jack. That's a great hand right there. That might take us. Closer, better, closer, warmer. Four discards remain. Well, let's burn one right there. <laughs> it's the same cards. You had a flush? Oh yeah. <laughs> Now we're talking. Give me aces and queens. Discard an eight. We need nothing. We made it. Okay, you have to spend something here. One extra hand remains. One interest. Ten mult if you have three of a kind. Plus 15 molt when three cards or fewer are played, and it gives us a plus 10 molt by default. I'm definitely going plus 10 default molt. And then if three or fewer cards are played, we get plus 15 molt. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, spades are debuffed. Duly noted. Um, discard the three. You know what? Discard an ace on this one. We got good straight potential. And let me just see what this pair does. Because we played three cards or fewer. And then also, we got plus 10 mult by default, right? Give me the plus 10. Give me the plus 15. That in and of itself is half of what we need. Why are you talking about the flush? If we played the flush, 
we would have gotten the, well, let's look at it. You know, you might be right. The flush would have given us 120 plus 10. Okay, yeah, that would have been like a thousand points. You got me on that one. Um, I mean, there's, there's some great stuff here. Holy. I'm just going low on the discards because I know we got it. We got 8, 9, 10, Jack, Queen. It's not going to give us the super multiplier, but we already have plus 10 multiplier. So that, sh that should be enough by itself, in my opinion. I'm not worried about the debuff. Don't sweat the debuff. Give me my plus 10. That's enough right there. Okay, okay. We've moved up our ante. Easy. $10 is the perfect amount. Permanently gain plus one hand per round, plus 10 molt if you have a straight, plus four molt for each even card. Being honest with you, one hand per round seems amazing, but getting four molt for each even seems out of control. Shop has an uncommon joker. I'm not skipping, I don't have enough money to, to justify skipping. Holy. Here's the, let's run the numbers here, okay? Two pair is 20 times two. But it's actually 20 times 12. A pair is 10 times two, but it's actually 10 times 27. So it's 270. And this is 240. So like playing two pairs is better, but it does also, when we played or sorry, playing a pair is better, but it does cost us one extra hand. So, okay, it's an interesting thing to think about. That's true, hands are worth one gold too if you manage to keep them. It's a good point. I guess it doesn't matter as much if you just get it on one hand to begin with. Oh, I forgot about the evens too, you're absolutely right. Ooh. 20 chips for each odd card played. Spawns a, a random joker must have room. I mean, this seems like I'm getting a joker. Well, I guess I'm getting a random joker. Random, okay. Let me. I thought $5 for a random joker seemed great, but then I realized this is a non-random joker for four. I think you go voucher here. I'd like to redeem, please. Thank you. Three bucks remain. I'll hold that three dollars. And move to the next round. A lot of interesting stuff going on here. I mean, just right off the bat, four, four, and then like discard a, I hate to say it, discard an ace in order to improve your odds of a straight draw. Let's see how many points this gives us right here. We got, we got evens, we got three cards or less. We got plus 27 multiplier. Like this in and of itself is not gonna get us there, but it'll get us pretty close. I hate to like be this guy. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 is also good, but I think we can get pretty far just by playing pairs right now and then using that third card space as like an extra discard which your four just got announced wii u exclusive yes i have a wii u you all laughed at me for a while i had two wii u's it's a wii us 20 chips for each odd ranked card. $2 per discard if no discards are used. I'm a simple man, I pass that. One in seven cards gets drawn face down. Well, I hate that. <laughs> um, I think we leave our straight potential open. 
Or do we know that these have to be lower? Like, that's the problem here. We do. Okay. I mean, that could be seven, eight, that could be six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We don't know that, but we can't really take a chance. I'll, I'll hit you with two of these and then play that for a discard. That should be worth a reasonable amount of points. Bro had two Wii U's. We call that an ambulance. So true. Sucks that that was a jack, but it is what it is. We got a good amount of points. Oh, it had to be a jack because... Oh! Oh, you're absolutely right. Okay, I see what you're saying. Because this, well, it could have been a queen as well, right? I see. Because this this could be a, a three, four, five, six, or seven. I see. You know what? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go four discards here. Let's let's use information. How about um, six, seven, eight, nine, ten has three evens in it. So that seems like a great. I think we just beat the boss right there. I can foresee a situation where you have to take a lark on one of the face down cards, which would be a lot of fun. Why not start the straight from the jack? I wanted to make sure that I had three even cards instead of two even cards. Because we get plus four multiplier for each even card. Plus two discards. Plus ten molt when zero discards. Spawns your all-time most used tarot planet card, Jupiter. <laughs> Which one's Jupiter? Is Jupiter like plus 10 molt for three of a kind? I can't remember. That is correct. That's my guess. Go to info. Oh, I don't know, man. It's for flush, not three of a kind. <laughs> Sounds crazy. I'm passing on this one. I just, I, I don't see it. Let me get the small blind here. Don't shoot the messenger. Let's, let's look at run info real quick. Four of a kind is, I mean, this is basically 3,000 points by itself at a minimum. So we might as well. We could also play three of a kind, it, it, just because it gives us the extra plus 15 molt, but... Did I say it was 6,000 points? <laughs> Either way, we're, we're okay, but I just, I, my math was like so off. You said 3,000? I thought it was 3,000. Either way, good start. What does the Rip Joker do? It's crazy. It gives us 10 molt flat. So every every card value or every hand value is already 10 times what it otherwise would be. And then it, if we play three cards or less, it also gives us plus 15. So it gives us times 25 if we play three cards or less. Hang on, I'm loaded. Go up to negative $20 in debt. I mean, for $3, that seems like an insane value. Face cards have a 1 in 3 chance to play $2, to give $2 when played. Uh, like, both of these seem incredible. Oh, but they are jokers, right? They, I mean, for now, we could just run them and then we'll discard later. <laughs> We should play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Donkey, donkey. I'm gonna discard first. I mean, I think we we basically own you. <laughs> I went for it. Um. Start me. I don't want to screw up the straight that much. Start me here, just because we get so many cards out of it. Is it financially sound to go into debt? Are you talking about real life or are you talking about in this video game? In real life, it's like almost not financially sound to not go into debt. 
But we don't need to get into that. Hang on, give me a discard real quick. I'm in the same situation. Give me 10-10. Give me queen, queen, because those are all evens, right? Twelve hundred points. Still need a little more. That's helpful. How about a four, five, six, seven, eight? It's a good hand and it gives us a lot of redraws. And we won anyway. Okay. What gives you a redraw in this? Either discarding or playing a card will replace the card in your hand. So sometimes you can just throw an extra card or two at a hand that's already valid just to get a free redraw out of it, basically. Copies the ability of the first tarot or planet card to the right of this, Mars. Mars on four of a kind, you get better. Spawns your all-time most used tarot planet card. Just because I'm starting to get a little scared, I'm going redraw. Reroll, I should say. One in five chance per hand played to upgrade poker hand level. One in four chance to add foil holographic or polychrome to a random joker. Okay. One in for five dollars, a one in four chance. Buy and use. Oh! <laughs> All right. Oh, one in five chance to upgrade the poker hand level. Sure, why not? And then take me to the next round. Subtracts discards from molts. Good to know. I don't really understand what that means, to be honest with you. But so I'm gonna go to like a negative one multiplier if I discard immediately. Am I crazy? Let, again, let's run the numbers. Seven, a, a pair of, two pair is 20 times two, but it's actually 20 times 12. One pair is 10 times two, but it's actually 10 times 27. Like a pair is better, plus we could just have a pair of evens and then discard an odd card. And we're not using a discard in the process. Plus 10 molt, plus 15 molt. That was 700 points. That's, that's roughly good enough. Now I'm like, I have to discard. Have to is maybe a strong word. Get rid of my 2-3 jack, discard me. Three sevens, it's not even, but it's... I mean, I get that we have a straight here too, but three sevens, let's look at run info here. It's gonna be like times... <laughs> three of a kind's good, but is straight better? We've gotten seven of those. I think we have to respect the ripped joker here. And then upgrade my hand, you piece. Oh, we want to use our discards faster. I was reading it backwards. It's a good hand. Four, five, six, eight, eight, nine, ten. No straight. No straight potential. Okay, so we want to discard as much as possible. But I don't want to discard anything. <laughs> My hand is it's like kind of good, but it's like not good enough. Well, you got to get rid of something. I'm dumping 9-10 ace. Call me crazy the way I'm dumping 9-10 ace. I'm dumping 3 queen king. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. That's a beautiful hand. Play that. We're using strategy. More, give me more, give me more. 
That's a 1200 point hand. That's a good one. And then with two hands remaining, I think we already have them. Can I get some evens? Let's play face cards to maximize our chances of getting more money. Oh, I should have done... Oh, no, but we have a limited number of hands. Okay, this, this might make sense given that we have a limited number of hands available. Now, all we need is $26. <laughs> this hand is going to go crazy. This is going to seem wrong, okay? You add a face card, even though it kills your multiplier from the ripped card, we're gonna get over 26 anyway. So we might as well just play this to have a chance to get two extra dollars. There's no reason to play a full house. We, we just need to cross 4,000. Let me see this bank. Let me see this business card pop. It did not pop. Okay, okay. That makes sense. It doesn't count unless it's part of the hand. All right, well, maybe I cooked too much. But you could tell where my head was at, at least. Reroll boss blind one time per ante, $10 per roll. <sighs> could, could be very important, but I'm not at that level yet. $4 end of round. Double the rank of lowest card held in hand to molt. So, if your hand has a lot of high rank cards, this goes crazy. Even if you have low rank cards, it's still pretty good. Oh, held in hand, held in hand, I see. So you actually would prefer to play lower value cards if possible. I honestly think like, goodbye to my credit card. I'm going econ mode right now. I'm not too worried about re-rolling the boss blind because I don't really know what bosses I'm trying to look for, honestly. One in four chance for the shop to have a holographic joker. No, we play these. We play these out. <clears throat> Always got to look for a flush. Just take a minute here. Just relax yourself. I mean, obviously, we have straight potential. We got we got great three of a kind potential though as well. This is a 10, 10, 10 play hand and we'll get an extra eight multiplier from our new thing as well. Ooh. How do we do? 2,500, 2,400, we take those. It's unfortunate. It's unfortunate because it's like so close to being too good. I'm, I can't believe I'm doing this. I'm discarding two, three, four. Five. No straight flush. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Should use all hearts. Maximize the chance of not... You should dump all of one suit to maximize your chances of drawing a flush in a different suit. That makes sense to me. Yeah, Dan was right. This game goes crazy. That was a gimme, though. This round was a gimme. Give me my interest. Ooh. <laughs> $14? Okay, I've been told. Wait, the, the stand-up comedian Joker? Trigger all 2, 3, 4, and 5 cards two times when played. Okay, so weaker cards go harder. This is also crazy because the trigger on the two and four would give us like double even bonuses. Reroll boss blind, I've been told I have to do because um, the boss counters my current build. So I would say thank you to chat for that one. Aces give extra plus four multi and 20 chips when played. Are there any jokers I hate? Well, the business card hasn't seemed to be that good. The space joker doesn't seem that solid, honestly, but I can see it saving us in a pinch, maybe. 
I feel like the extra molt from two, th two, three, four, well, just from twos and fours is worth taking a lark on for at least a couple rounds. And then I gotta, I gotta re-roll you. <laughs> I'd like to re-roll the, the boss blind, please. This is just for sport. I know it ruins the plus 15 molt from our Joker here, but like, what does a full house give us point-wise? We can just get a bead for it. We're gonna get lots of even multiplications here as well. Did we get, did we get two extra dollars out of any of those face cards? I feel like we might have been better just playing three kings and then waiting to possibly draw um, three sevens or three nines give me a discard i mean nine let's, let's check it out let's play nine 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 and see how that works out instead plus 10 plus 15. so there's 1700 i don't know <laughs> maybe not dummy dummy <sighs> we don't get benefits from aces i didn't take that one get rid of it so a, a full house is going to go crazy for us. Note to self, full house still beats three of a kind right now, probably. Tw yeah, roughly. Okay. I don't know why, is flush the most overrated hand in poker? People will be like, yeah, you got a 6,000 point full house, but you could have had like a 900 point flush. Golden Joker! <laughs> One in four chance to add a random... Go up to $20 a day. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna buy and use. You can do this. Oh! Next round, please. I would like to reroll. Reroll re boss for $10. All clubs are debuffed. Totally fine. Totally fine. 